What's good, fight fans? It looks like a fight between Mikey Garcia and Manny Pacquiao is really going to happen. Negotiations are getting really, really close to making a fight for May. Mikey himself stated that the fight details are being finalized and the host for this fight is very high. Garcia, who is 40 and one with 30 KOs, moved up to welterweight in 2019, having never fought above 140 before in his life and was picked apart and dominated by undefeated welterweight Errol Spence Jr. 11 months later, in his most recent fight, he beat Jesse Vargas, though it was close and competitive. Compared to Manny Pacquiao, who was now 62-7-2 with 39 KOs, who beat Vargas easily back in 2016. But Pacquiao Garcia will generate a lot of interest. Manny is still the biggest active global name in the sport and still fighting very well at his age, coming off a spectacular victory over former unified undefeated hard-hitting welterweight Keith one-time Thurman. And Garcia is a Mexican-American, a great opponent with just one loss. With Canelo versus Saunders on the horizon for May 8th, also Ramirez Taylor for May 22nd. That leaves open dates of May 1st, May 15th, and May 29th for Saturday nights. So options are available for the month of May. Now with that said, I'm going to give my analysis on this fight, starting with the two fighters' physical dimensions. Pacquiao has 62 wins, 7 losses with 2 draws with 39 wins coming by way of knockout. He stands at five foot five and a half with a 67 inch arm reach. And Mikey Garcia has 40 wins with one loss with 30 wins coming by way of knockout. He stands at five foot six with a 68 inch arm reach. Obviously there are no major physical differences between the two, but the most outstanding difference is that Manny Pacquiao is older with the more experience. He's a eight division world champion in boxing's only eight division world champion and won 12 major world titles throughout his career. And on the other hand, Mikey Garcia is a four division world champion and is a pretty solid fighter. Do I believe he could beat Manny Pacquiao? Absolutely not. But he has a very good chance being that Manny Pacquiao is an older individual now. I mean, but with Manny Pacquiao, you never know. We were saying that with Keith Thurman, but he completely beat up Keith Thurman. And stylistically, I think this is very convenient for Manny Pacquiao. Mikey Garcia is a come forward fighter and his footwork is definitely not up to par with that of Manny Pacquiao. Also, Manny Pacquiao has the overwhelming hand speed advantage. And to me, it's just gonna be night and day for Manny Pacquiao. I also have to take into account that Manny Pacquiao hasn't fought since 2019, but I honestly don't think that ring rust will play a role in his performance. He has shown in the past that he is an experienced, great fighter and just has that natural ability to adjust to a situation. This will be a huge fight for Mikey Garcia and definitely the biggest fight of his life. I'm sure he's coming to win and getting a Manny Pacquiao fight is a high risk, high reward type of situation. And this will be a great business move for Mikey Garcia and his camp. And Mikey, of course, is not the only one who wants a Manny Pacquiao fight. You have people like Errol Spence Jr. who wanted a Manny Pacquiao fight when Manny Pacquiao was the welterweight champion. And Terrence Crawford, who still wants to fight, which is obviously to add Manny Pacquiao's name to his resume and to get a big check. And his eyes should be on nobody but Errol Spence Jr. But I'm not going to get into that because that is one of the most biggest headaches in boxing right now. If that fight were not to happen, that would be a huge travesty of boxing. But I'm looking forward to see how this fight between Mikey Garcia and Manny Pacquiao plays out. And that's pretty much it. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And thank you for watching.